In this Wix website builder tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change images and replace your images here on your Wix website. Now there's three different ways I'm going to show you because images can be placed in many different ways. In this first example, this image is actually inside of a strip that has columns. So this strip element then has two columns and this column on the right, when I click on it, I can select to manage that column and it's actually an image set as the background. So you can see here we can change the background. So we're gonna click change background and inside of this column background dialog window, we can choose a lot of different options. We could change it to a color, a video, or an image. And if I click this image button here, it's gonna pull open our media and you can change the image from many different areas. So you can change it from media from Wix or other stock websites. You can use the AI, AI image creator. You can also go to your site files where you maybe already have images uploaded that you can utilize. You can also go and hit this blue button and just upload media from many different places, including your computer. Now I already have an image uploaded, so I'm gonna click off of here. So I've got this little profile photo and I'm gonna insert this image by selecting it and then going down to change background. Now it's gonna come in and it maybe doesn't look right at first. The reason for that is there are some settings to background options that you can change. And I can change those here in this settings button. And if I scroll down here, I see scaling and positioning. How is this image scaled? Right now it's tiled, so you'll see it duplicated. You could also select original size. For me, I, pick an, I picked an image that is smaller, so the original size doesn't work either. So what I need to do is scale it to fill. And so it's gonna fill in the space just like that image did before. And then you can also adjust positioning. So if this image, which is true, it's like a square versus a rectangle, I can actually shift it in case I want the focal point to be a certain spot uh, in the image. So I can shift this around with these uh, positioning options here. Now I want it to be centered in this case. And yes, if you're looking at this and you think this image doesn't look very good, it's because I didn't have a high quality photo that I uploaded. So make sure your photos are high quality if you're uploading them to your site. Now that's one way to do it. So this was a column background image. Uh, let's go ahead and navigate to another site or another page. Uh, we'll go to portraits. Inside of portraits, what I have here is actually a media gallery. So it's a Wix Pro gallery. If I click and select it, you'll see I have multiple images here and I can go and manage the media in that gallery. So sometimes images are uh, placed on your site within galleries. And so you go manage it and you have multiple images here and you of course can change the layout and everything. But in here to replace an image or change an image, we can either add media to this gallery to add new ones or we can select the image we wanna replace like this first one here and click replace image here on the right just below the image preview and we get that same window that pops up so you remember this from before we could just select some site media like this picture again and click add to page and it's going to replace it uh, with this picture here now inside of this we do have options here where we can go edit the image we can change the crop and the scale uh, we can even upscale with ai right here we can rotate and flip so if it's not the same aspect ratio as the rest of your images, you can go in and adjust that. Um, I bring this up because when we hit done here, I'm guessing it might look a little different in this uh, gallery. No, they went ahead and cropped it anyway. So that works out well. So we changed that first image uh, to this picture of me. Um, so that's another way that you might encounter images on your site. The last way and maybe the easiest way is just a regular image. So I'm going to go to the contact page. Now this image is placed within a strip again. However, this image has just been placed inside of the page or just on the page. So if you were to go to this plus icon and add an element and select image and just upload your own or select any of these images and just kind of put it on your page, that would be what this image is. And so sometimes things are a few clicks away. So I've got to click a couple of times. It's within this group here. So I click again and I've got down to the image level. And once I have that image selected, you will see a change image button. We click that and guess what? The same thing pops up. We can select a different image. 
We'll see if this uh, actually changes the crop of this image or not. So we're going to choose this one. And it does. So it places it within the bounds of uh, these handles here on the side. So the size that I had the image, it goes ahead and, and puts that image in there. Uh, and it doesn't, you know, resize it and make it square because the image I brought in was square. It just replaces within those handles uh, this image. And so that's how you can change images and replace images really quick and easy here on Wix. Sometimes images are placed in different ways, like in galleries uh, as background images, or in this case, just a regular image here on your Wix website.